first off, tell me who you are. Do I look at you or them? Uh, look at me. Okay. I'm Dorina Sackman, the Florida Teacher of the Year for 2014 and a national finalist. So, Dorina, I wanted you to sort of recap um, what this week has been for you and sort of the significance now moving ahead. This week was very unexpected. I didn't, uh, the amount of professional development that I received, I mean, every time uh, 53 amazing educators get together and collaborate, it's, it's a pretty amazing experience. But to see all of our sponsors, like People to People, and to see amazing individuals that really support education, that's really what it is. We aren't alone as teachers. There are so many people out there, like People to People, that support us and want so much to improve education for our children and to elevate our profession for teachers. But I mean, it's wonderful to have these wonderful dinners and it's great to speak with all of our colleagues, but the amount of opportunity we had to really advocate for our platforms and to give other teachers in our states a voice was absolutely unprecedented. It was fantastic. So I know that you deal with a lot of foreign nationals in your classroom. Talk about, talk about why global awareness, global understanding, being a global citizen is important for education, educators and students. I think the whole premise of education should be that. Uh, as we look at our society, it's getting smaller and our world is getting smaller through technology, but also through the amount of individuals that are coming to our country. And they really, it's important for us to have the cultural competency and the professional development to understand those individuals who are coming to our classrooms. But really, it's just we need to broaden our horizons a little bit more. For all of us to truly understand each other, we need to learn about each other. And the best way for us to do that is to truly ask for those who come from these countries and truly infuse that into our lessons. And also, an even better example is to go to the countries of the students that have come here for a better opportunity or for whatever reason they've decided to come and study in our American education system. And then if we could do the same exact thing for our students and have them travel around the world and see the world, because a lot of times the confines of one classroom is limited. But if we think outside the box and actually explore this world of ours, the citizens that we will create, the understanding, the compassion, and not the word tolerance, but the word acceptance for every single culture and every single person, regardless of their background, socioeconomic background, linguistic background, and I think that we would create better citizens for our future, and then that would then have a domino effect in the future to come.